The Sabrunitsa Memorial Cemetery, the final resting place for thousands of people slaughtered during the Bosnian War. Fazila Efendic, a survivor, lost her only child and many more relatives in the Srebrenica massacre. Radko Mladic had the ultimate responsibility for all the crimes. He ordered the killings and he must be held accountable under international law. In the final months of the war, Bosnian Serb forces under Radko Mladic command took control over Srebrenica. What happened after has been described as one of Europe's worst atrocities since World War II. Over the course of 10 days, troops rounded up and executed more than 8,000 Muslim men and boys, dumping their bodies in mass graves. In 2017, the International Criminal Court found Mladic guilty of genocide and other war crimes during the conflict that took place between 1992 and 1995. In Sarajevo, the families of victims are also hoping that the court's decision will be upheld. Mladic having participated in the deadly 43-day siege of the capital, killing thousands of people. Two, three, five, six or even seven children were killed in a group, mostly while playing and mostly with intent. This was planned. It was part of the aggressor's strategy. Although it is unlikely that judges will overturn their verdict, survivors fear that his sentence might be reduced. After Slotoban Milosevic and Radovan Karadzic, Mladic is the last figure in a trio of Bosnian Serb leaders to face justice.